Welcome back to more Crusader Kings 3, our Iceland to India adventure. Although, as I was just saying, we've now made it to India. And as you can see, we've tweaked our kingdom title. We're now the Kingdom of Ice Lanka. And we've also tweaked the banner. We went through uh, a few different options and decided on Twitch Live that um, taking our house banner that we created right at the start of the series would make the most sense for adopting that for our brand new kingdom. It's an it's a lion holding an axe, riding an elephant across the water. And I think that basically just sums up our, our adventure here in our kingdom. From winter's ice to summer's spice. So yes, the kingdom of Ice Lanka. That's now our kingdom title. We'll have to make, I guess, the Empire of India and then change that to the Empire of Ice... Icelander? I don't know. We've taken a look at some of the culture options. And we've decided we're just going to hybrid culture with uh, Sinhala that's present here on Sri Lanka where we've invaded to begin uh, our adventure in India. And we've checked in Tribal Innovations. They do have um, they do have access to Elephant Tree. So that's what we want, War Elephants. They don't have the tradition of Lord of Elephants. That's only present over here. It's too far away for us to be able to form a hybrid culture. We could just conquer our way up there, but it'll probably take too long. I'd rather just start forming our hybrid culture sooner rather than later. So we're going to go for Sinhala. Uh, already have a pretty good idea of what various traditions we're going to keep. Mainly our Norse traditions and take one or two of them. But yeah, we'll get that cultural and regional elephant tree, which is great. Um, yeah, that's, that's basically the main ones that we, that we care about here. We'll keep, obviously, our, our traditions that we've got through... Nor so that will you know keep our our long ships all thing Varangian adventures I assume hopefully we don't care about the Varangian adventures anymore to be honest we don't need to do that but long ships is quite useful allows us to raid overseas as well uh, we'll stay unreformed uh, Norse uh, as well so that we can continue raiding because we're going to need a lot of prestige gain a lot of prestige so that we can get Lord of Elephants which improves. Um, improves the effectiveness of elephants and yeah we just we basically want to have like loads of men at arms elephant riders because why not we can actually get another men at arms regiment right now um i think i'm going to bring back the husk skulls that i got rid of i'm going to get rid of bring back the husk skulls that i got rid of although actually no you know what i'm just going to hold off on that i'm going to bring in elephants straight away i'm going to bring in elephants um that's what i'm going to do we do so in order to do that hybrid culture all we need to do is get cultural acceptance um, of Sinhala to uh, over 20. It's currently it's less. Um, so to do that, we need to go to our steward and promote cultural acceptance. And yeah, let's just do it at our at our capital. How long is that going to take? Oh, it's just active. It's so 0 0.84 per year. So if we go here, cultural acceptance is now rising. It's going to take a little while. Don't you... I think there's events as well that you can get. I think there's events. Recent changes to it were the, was the war. So hopefully maybe over time it will come back the other way. Yearly change. Gain. Yeah. Vassalage. Um, because of all the vassals here. I assume... Can I ransom you? For some gold. Are you gaining gold? You are. We'll wait until you'll give me some more then. Right. Let's. Artifacts of low dur uh, durability. Okay. Um, let's reforge or repair. Yep. Yeah. Uh, 38 gold. We don't want to lose that, that axe. We also need to hold our royal court as well. Disable buildings. Main limit. We're in here on 12 months being above it. Oh, okay, I didn't know about that. So that, that's that's kind of new to me that there's now actual penalties there. We can create the duchy. So we are now a we've now got a king king title, so we're now a proper king. We need to give away a little bit of territory. So I was hoping I would hold on to all of this duchy. So we'll give away these two over here. This guy hates us. Um Oh, so that's these two I've got to give away, isn't it? So let's grant this to 
Keep it in the family. Give it to Ragnar. Let's give it to Ragnar. Let's give him those two bits. And uh, if I have more gold, that will give me more prestige. So when we maybe go raiding, we'll create that and give it to him. There you go, Ragnar. That sorts out our domain limit. We... Yeah, come back here. I was thinking, I was looking at Colts. I was thinking, why does that not the same color? There we go. We could go. We're going to take back the Maldives as well. Uh, I'm actually going to murder this guy because we've got truce for 35 years from the Varenkin adventure. So let's start murdering him. Oh no, I'm a little bit stressed. What a shame. Let's order mass eviction. Mm, nope. Scrape the barrel. <laughs> Commission an artifact. No, you don't want to do that. Commission an epic. We do want to do that, but we need more gold. We do need more gold. Um, don't want to attempt suicide. No, 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 no. I mean, we're going to die soon. We're 60. And we are infirm. Thankfully, a Tim will rule over India. Um, we'll rule over Ice Lanka soon. Soon, soon, soon. Your wife is amazing, mate. I'm glad that's worked out. Um, hold feast. We need more gold. And we can't do that one for a few more years. Okay, well, let's just hold the court and hope that doesn't stress us out. Hold court. Here, petitioners. Let's do it. Hold court. Commencement. Sitting on my throne, I gesture for my guards to open the doors of the hall. A stream of people file in, some lining up the front, uh, in front of my throne, while others move out of the way so they can simply observe the proceedings. After several moments, all movement in the chamber has ceased. All faces turn towards mine expectantly. In front of me, I count three petitioners lined up in an orderly row, waiting for me to call on them. Gesture for the first in line to approach. On second thought, it's a beautiful day outside. No. We will hear the first petitioner. My vassal, Count uh, Mahanaga, approaches me, glancing around like he often does. My lord, I have a brilliant idea. How about we host a fair, or perhaps even a festival, for the common folk to expose them to one of the different cultures in our beautiful kingdom? Uh, Mahanaga explains his idea further until he realizes that he's dangerously close to over explaining it. It'll cost money, but I'm sure it'll help foster a more positive relationship between our people. This is what I was thinking of when I was uh, trying to remember if there was a cultural acceptance um, event. There is. We'll hold a big festival celebrating both our cultures, which instantly gives us cultural accept acceptance 20% between Norse and Sinhalas, which is what we want. So this actually works out perfectly we could host a small one which would give us 10 percent cultural acceptance or you holding uh, uh, an exhibit show norse greatness or well, i can't spend the resources no we do actually have the money to do this so let's go for a grand festival this means we don't need to do that promote culture and wait ages for that to happen perfect uh a shadow in the night uh the man who approaches my throne is clearly a commoner my lord he begins his speech I represent the local community of Putalam. In the last few months, our cemeteries have been plagued with the disappearance of bodies. All have been dug up and left no trace. At first, we feared wild animals or obscure powers at work. But your own court physician, Berta, was caught red-handed, hauling the dead away for her experiments. Please put a stop to this blasphemy, sire. <laughs> So we can say studying the human body is a sad necessity. Encourage grave robbing for 10 years. Uh, minus 25 popular opinion. Um, means 50% intrigue and learning lifestyle experience. Berta. Why didn't you invite me, Berta? <laughs> Gain some dread. I spend six court grandeur. We don't want to lose grandeur. Can help it. Fresh living bodies make for better test subjects. I imprison him. Um, and I get a lot of stress. Guards, arrest the grave robber. She's dismissed my court physician. She's pretty good, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, she's a renowned physician. But to just cut it off. Um, safe cemeteries. I think I'm just have to say, just cut it off. Because, um, yeah, we want to keep her. And we don't want to upset the locals. So, just cut it off. 
Surely cut it off, cut it out. Well, that's the right thing. Um, Mayor Sunni and Mayor uh, Vemunde uh, marched to my throne with their discontent clear. Sunni flares up, my lord, I seek the perceptive peasant Signy as my woman. Her dancing is talked of across uh, all of Icelandia. Uh, Vemunde cuts him off. I have long been negotiating with her family. This brash boar is a sad and jealous coveter. Ah, so it's, of course, fighting over a woman. Isn't it always the same? She is pretty. She's a mighty fine prowess as well. Um, surely it's like, she. I, I can take her as my woman. <laughs> it upsets both of them. And uh, Dancer, I don't have time for this. Um, diplomacy challenge. I gained six court grandeur. I'm going to go for that. Let's gain some grandeur. Royal court is now at level four. Nice. I forget what all the different levels do. Here we go. We can see it here. Pretty sure there's a way of checking them all out in a minute. Uh, conclusion. The last petitioner departs. Various courtiers follow them out of the room, having business to attend elsewhere. Others remain talking amongst themselves about the recent proceedings. Soon the ceremonial formality of the proceedings has dropped away entirely with the hum and bustle of normal courtly life taking its place. My business here is done. So the throne room. Court grandeur. Here we go. So as it goes up, we get bonuses for our uh, our levies. Powerful vassal councillor, levy based contribution plus 10%. All the way up to, to 10 gives us size of men at arm regiments plus 1. Also, we get more renown. Uh, month of, that's, that's a great amount, actually, at 9. Courtiers who have lived in the Royal Court for 5 years gain a more powerful special trait based on court type. Nice. More chance to imprison. Men at arms effect. Uh, counter efficiency. Good. Unlocks convinced de jure territory councillor task. Oh, nice. Courtiers who have lived in the Royal Court for five years gain a special trait based on the court type. Knight effectiveness is 10% with that one. More prestige. Current court grandeur expectation. Three levels above it, causing plus one, uh, 1. 1.6 prestige a month. Fellow vassal opinion plus 20, independent ruler opinion plus 20, vassal opinion plus 12, and courtier and guest opinion plus 16. That's great. We can improve things, can't we, by increasing our spending. Yeah, it costs us some gold, but we can get fashion. More prestige is always good. That would be useful. Decent fashion. We're going to need a lot of prestige. Let's go to decent fashion. Oh, because we can see where it's currently... What we're currently doing, we'll maintain it at this level. We're currently trending down from 4 back down to level 1. So we have to do various things to improve it back up. So that will get it to there. Bland food, what does this do? Stress loss for courtiers and guests. Not for me, though, I'm guessing. Um, does the owner fe feast activity reduces more stress? Oh, that ah, so that does it from this level, from decent food onwards. I was about to try and do a feast. I've had more gold. Court grandeur bonus plus sixteen. Small health boost. Let's go for decent food. It's going to cost us zero point eighty a month. That's fine. Um, lodgings is guests are likely to stay longer. Spacious lodgings. Okay, that's going to cost quite a bit. Very few servants. Little power scheme. Hostile schemes. Oh, some servants. That will keep us between three and four. We'd have to have it increase our lodgings up a little bit. It costs 140 to keep the court at this level. Let's try and keep it at this level for now. Because we are producing 4.9 right now. Court type warlike? Or intrigue? No, keep it at warlike. 100%. Court language. Grandeur bonus. We were gonna we we're gonna take on their language soon, to be honest. Uh 
Um, oh, back to my court. So that one, that one, that one. That one. Apply that. Lock it in. Change. Now I've got decent fashion, decent food, small lodgings, and some servants. The plan is to take India over. Getting here was just the just the start. So our court grandeur will dr is actually going to increase now as well. It's, it's, uh, from 31, it's trending to a baseline of 32. Perfecto. Ranked 26th in the world. Lovely. And what we've got? Court artifacts. Let's, oh, I should have put some of these up. That would have helped. We can put in our own banner. There we go. Perfect. And then large wall ornament. We could hang up the carling banner. We'll only get... Because we don't fulfill their requirements. We only get plus two court grandeur. Same with that one. We can add in another one. Because we've already got the dynasty banner. This is the house banner. Oh, no. My bad. That's that's the one there. There we go. I didn't choose the right one. And it takes from there. We've already... We've maxed it out, have we? It keeps moving it around. Displaying two of three. Oh, th two of three banners. Um, might as well chuck that one up there, then, that we've taken. What can we put in as a book? Famed book? I didn't even realise I had this. When did I get this? Inherited along... Oh, with the kingdom when we took it. That gives us renown plus 5%. Court grandeur plus 3. Monthly life learning lifestyle experience plus 15%. Nice. Yeah, pop that book up there. Um, can we put anything else up? Don't have any other... That's, that's for books. No artifact available. No pedestal items. Claims? No. Sweet. So if we go back here, we can see it's going up to a baseline of 40. So we're going up to the rank uh, level 5 then. Perfect. So we can we can drop some of these down if we need to uh, in 12 months. Perfect. What is our renown gain now? Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Right, we're trying to assassinate this guy. Um, he's proving very difficult to assassinate. Support schemes, would you? And what's this? Entertainment. Uh, Epicurean Entertainment. Ah, excellent. Fresh quail, my favourite. Thorin uh, bellows merrily. Gorging herself as the servant desperately studies, uh, steadies the serving tray. Oh, my beloved saffron cakes, you are truly delectable, Helga says with a singing voice. Now, this is what life's all about. Servants, more invigorating herbal infusions. Now, Carl demands. It would appear that my courtiers are enjoying themselves. Charming as well. Oh my god. Come as your friend because I'm sadistic. I shouldn't let them. I should let them be. Oh, I'm not a very social person because I'm sadistic. I don't. <laughs> okay, yeah, this is, I should let them be. Court grandeur increases. Boom. It's going to hold level there at 40. That's fine. That is fine. Right, let's see if that brings anyone else in. 20%. Oh, dear. Zero catch can be... Yeah, because... I'm assuming... Uh, there's barely anyone as part of his court. That's why. His sphere of influence. We're going to have to hope we get lucky with some schemes here. Otherwise, well, that's not going to happen for a little while. Um, but we should now be able to hybrid culture this thing up. Yeah, we're at 20%. Form hybrid culture. Let's do it. So we are, we've decided we're going to go for Bellicose, North Germanic, and Sinhalese. Kind of more from a role play perspective. Makes the most sense there. Traditions, we're going for Malleable Invaders for creating hybrid culture. I don't know if that will affect it this time. Um, but we are, well, actually, we are Malleable Invaders already. So that should, yeah, keeping that should be useful. Plus, if we ever need to divert, um, diverge the culture or form another hybrid one at some point, that should be useful. Keep that one. We're taking on City Keepers from the Sinhalese because city building and construction time reduction 25% is always good. Architecture trait provides prestige bonus. Our next character is a stewardship focused character. So hopefully he's already got architect or we can send him that way. Um, that would be useful. Big emphasis on keeping or, or taking on anything that boosts our prestige gain because we'll need all the prestige um, for this playthrough for 
interacting with our with our culture more and gaining new innovations and traditions and things like that we're keeping coastal warriors because that's just great and we want all those unique men arms northern stories for more prestige gaining options and performative honor for shield maiden so we've got rid of ting meat uh that's fine we got rid of the ruling cast from the sinhalese so that's all good there aesthetics we're keeping north uh norse for our military equipment because we're proud warriors name practices will take on both now which also means that people on twitch suggesting names can now suggest hybrid Nor uh indo norse names as well uh we're gonna go for norse architecture um i just like the idea of the norse you know just stamping their mark across land by building their own structures and it'll just be interesting fashion will take on both coat of arms i'm gonna keep them as norse because again coat of arms i'm kind of leaning more to the the militaristic side of them um you know proudly being displayed on shields and things like that let's, let's have that as more norse and keeping that tradition there uh, rather than both we might change this at some point uh we've called it uh icelandian as our culture our fact our kingdom is icelandia but our culture is icelandian so there we go that's all set up let's form our hybrid culture <laughs> The Icelandian hybridization, spurred on by positive relations and increasing cultural exchange, the Sinhala and the Norse peoples have grown increasingly close over the years. Now individuals from these societies have begun to view themselves not as one or the other, but as both. Simultaneously, a new Icelandian culture. Norse traditions and values form the backbone of this new culture, while various Sin, uh, Sinhala attributes have been adapted and integrated to meet the needs of their new society. With the Icelandian people now looking for, to me for guidance, it is time to set the stage for our shared future. To a new age, a new era, a new people. There we go. North structure and Indian weather sounds warm. Yeah, toasty, eh? Right, so those, that's what we've got there. We can reform it or we can divulge it. Uh, diverge it rather, not divulge it. We can reform it or we can diverge it. Uh, innovations. Um, there we go. So yeah, we've got long ships. Um, it's not present in, uh, oh, wait, no, so we don't get that one. We do get elephant tree though. Frangian adventures, we still have that, all things. It's, not it's got to be present in Northern Europe. Okay. I did not know that one. So what does it stop? Uh, locks the ability to raid overseas if you can already raid. Okay. Unlocks the ability to sail mails with rivers, embarkation costs. Okay. So we'd need to get seafarers then to make up for that actually. Um, that's fine. We can add that one in. 12 counties in Northern Europe are Icelandian. Yes, yeah, so we're not going to get that long ships back. But that's okay. We can still raid, thankfully. Thanks to staying unreformed. But the main thing was to get elephant tree, which means we can now go in here. Oh, look. Men at arms slot free. Elephants. We need 360 gold. Better go raiding then. <laughs> we better go raiding. Um, also, we do not need to now promote cultural acceptance because we've already got it. Promote culture, though. Might want to do a little bit of that. Um, how long does it take? We'll complete in three years. Complete in eight years. Uh, that's not part... I don't own that one, so let's take let's take over that one. Eight years, though. That's going to take an absolute crazy time. Raw Diak. Right, 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 right. Um, yeah, let's just get these guys at full strength. New cultural fascination. Uh, fasc fascination. Uh, what are we even going for right now? We've got... Uh, we haven't got that one, actually. We'll gain that within six years, though, so that's fine. We have reached this area, so we're going through this one. Hereditary rule. Enact partition law. That's what we want to push through right now. Hereditary rule so that we are no longer on confederate partition which sucks um ragnar you will take that duchy that's fine you'll get all of those prince tim good 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 Just five times speed it so we get us up to full strength. Uh, purchase a truce to the handsome King Eric. Oh my. 
You and I should be friends, not foes. Please accept this gift in exchange for your signature. Uh, who are you? Uh, so I'm about to go raid you. Hmm. I am going to decline it. Yep. Yeah. My fight over this thing. Which, a matter of life and death. Grimmer and Ingrid escalated dramatically. Apparently, the key point of the contention is a colossal prize pig, which Grimmer stole from Ingrid, or Ingrid from Grimmer. Honestly, with all the yelling, it's quite unclear. Now, both of the uh, Shruvirs... Oh, yeah, that's what it's taken on yet. Yeah, Shruvirs are now my champions, my knights. Yeah, yeah. Openly challenged each other to a Holm gang. The duel is sure to be dramatic, but as sworn members of my household, they need permission to go ahead with the fight. By all means, I'll wager on Ingrid. Um, there's a 95% chance that Ingrid wins. Uh, Grimmere gets wounded. Yeah, she's got 20. She's a berserker, mate, and a giant. You're, you're going to get slapped here. Uh, they may fight over this if they may, may wish. I lose some stress because I'm just... I kind of need to lose some stress. Also, we need to... I love my that my beard's grown. I'm going to tweak my crown, though. I forbid it to gain some dread. Eh, no, because there's only 18% uh, chance that succeeds. I am... I am going to go for stress reduction. Ingrid wins. Well done. Well done, Ingrid. Ah, they're going warlike courtier. Nice. 19 others. Sweet. More martial, more prowess. Just what we want. Perfection. Perfection. Um, right. Tweak that crown. Oh, kind of a... a, a a turban Norse. Kind of like it. It's pretty, pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. Um, golden Makuta with a massive diamond. When I'm an em emperor, definitely. That's how I show who's boss. Um, Oz cap. <laughs> Where my cap? Kind of like, actually, having them with their uh, gilded... Uh, Good German blue helmet. Definitely not how you say it. Norse Imperial crown. Go for the gilded one. I like that. Oh, yeah, it just looks cool. With the white beard. That's great. Yep, you're good. I was going to get you educated by someone with intrigue. Yep. Boom. Prisons can be ransomed. Not yet. Give me, when you've got more gold. I can create the Dutch, but I need more money to do that. Um, let's raise all as raiders. Do, 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 do. I am going to have Carl lead these guys. He's a mighty Varengian. Have you guys recovered from the last time I raided you? A little bit. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go raiding. We need 360 gold to get elephant men arms. That's what we're going to do. The quest for elephants begins today. Raiding, no. Shopping with extreme prejudice. Yes. <laughs> Spouse skill. Oh, she's gained architect. Lovely. Amazing, wife. Top work. Oh, have we got any better chance on this whole intrigue thing? Mm, no, that's not going to go well, is it? Friendly exchanges. Good, good. Oh, that one's worth 31. Hello. India, you are ripe for plunder. A helping hand. Means pious uh, contacts. That is a 96% chance. Yes, do it. We need all the help we can possibly get. Oh, no. 
Alice died. My Rex Godie. We've now got you in place. And, ooh, you're infirm and not good. Alice was... How good was she? She's 19. Prison's taken the siege. Ransom you. They don't have the gold or they just don't like them. Unimportant call to you. That sucks. No, come on. We must find a better one. Okay, no. Um, Right, what about we find a spouse? <laughs> we use you to marry in a better one and then we then make them our new Godie. Um, of the Peasant Revolt. At least you're Norse. Yeah, let's bring... Oh, no, this guy. Much younger. There we go. Bring you in. Matrilineal. Wait for it. Then we fire her and replace her with her husband. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, convert the faith. That's, that's going to go well, isn't it? How long is that going to take? 25 years! There is zero point doing that, isn't there? Yeah, screw that. New Marshall Perk. Lovely. Never back down. Lovely. Yeah, we're just going through that now for him. He doesn't endorse me. Son of a gun. Uh, I will sway you. There we go. Oh, and Bert has just died. What did you die of? Old age. Um, I still need to lower my stress as well. And we were going to go for... Uh, oh, no, I am thought. Shame. Wait, I'm certain. No, stay where I am. Um, I'm going to him. I'm not getting any luck. Yeah, sorry. Court position is what I was looking for. Let's... Search for some. Court physician. You are a renowned physician. And you're maybe a witch. I don't know. Let's take on uh, Nimala. Cost us a bit of gold, but that's okay. Right, hit these guys now because their settlements are so ripe for plunder. I love it. On to the next one. Whoa! That was sudden and sharp and a little bit unexpected, but also not. We, we were infirm. We, we've died. Just like that. <laughs> Just like that. Okay. King Eric of Ice Lanka's soul has finally been cast to hell at 61 years of age. He died of old age. A known murderer, he will atone for his unspeakable crimes in the next life. King Tim ascends the throne. Being both thrifty and frugal, the realm will surely prosper under his rule. I'm going to jinx it now, but he is the chosen one. The chosen Tim. At least Eric managed to complete his father's... His father's? At least Eric managed to complete his father's legacy and his father's dream of getting from Iceland all the way to India. That's what he managed to achieve. Plus, he formed a hybrid culture. And now we will reap the benefits with his son, the second Tim. Continue as King Tim. Okay, we're currently raiding. That can continue. Dynasty head changed. Our boar became the new dynasty head. Um, dynasty head, remind me again how these ones work. Dynasty heads based off of... Is it the amount of prestige or the amount of territory you have? We had that trouble in my... Um, oh, what's you call it? Restoration of the Roman Empire series where we had a di uh, diverged house, didn't we? Uh, something like that. A um, cadet branch. Supposedly the size of your army. Oh, really? What? That can't be right. 
His army's tiny compared to mine. Right. Stewardship bonus. What have you done so far? You're going to Aravacious. Fearful troops. Oh, yeah. The whole, I was thinking we don't need to worry about that stress now. We also don't need to worry about that murder plot, which has been cancelled anyway. But I can now go after you anyway because uh, we don't have that truce agreement, that, that treaty. So what have you got? Golden obligations. Demand payment for hooks. War profiteer. Monthly income while at war. Wear girl. Last tax contribution. You've actually done too much here. Architect, though, has benefits for us. And I would like to do a load of building. Tax man, collect tax efficiency, building cost reduction. War profit profiteer is pretty useful. I think we'll push through. We'll keep what we've got here at Aravation. Then we'll go through Architect. Keep you on stewardship. Um, monthly income pass 10%. Domain. For, I think I'm going to focus on domain for now. Keep that going. Let's take a look at the wife. She's assisting me right now, which gives a good spread across pretty much all my traits. Chivalry could give us plus 10 martial. I think I'm going to stick to the general assist because that's just a good boost across all of them. Queen Sif is an absolute genius. And uh, we've got two kids right now. Let me get more. Why is she not really like me? Um... Right. Uh, she's not our faith. Can I convert her? Not yet. But let's do the old seduce. Okay. No, we've got a low chance of that. Let's do the old romance. That's even worse. We don't want to be kicked out of the marital bed. That would be terrible. Uh, let's just sway her for now. Let's just sway her and see if that improves our chances with the other things. We can also hold court. Oh, and our court's changed completely. I have a new court artifact. Must be a banner. No. Oh, the book's no longer being placed. Yeah, place the book, please. Thank you. Oh, no, go back to my court. Um, baseline of 25 is going up to 34. We're just shy of that one. Um, let's... All like court, yeah, that's fine. Court grandeur bonus. Oh, do we need to change it to? Do we need to change our language? No, I can't change it. That just tells me what it's set to. Oh no, click to view Norse. I thought we would change that on over. Maybe it's have I got to? adapt to it maybe over time just check our prisons to ransom ransom you how much gold are you gaining month one wait for a little bit there and yeah wait for you give me the full amount for those mace is low durability um clements So what, can you can you go to war someone over an item, an, an artifact now? Let's just unpause things. I became the new dynasty head. Nice. Good. As a bloody should do. As a ruddy should do. Getting a decent amount through that. One king, one duke. Two dukes, rather. That's also good. Faction. Install Prince Ragnar. On the Athelankian throne. Yeah, ain't gonna end well for you, is it? Experienced fighter. You are... I'd say hired, but I can't do that just yet. Matrilineal, and then you join the court. Bada bing, bada boom. Wait for it. Wait for it. Excellent. Do do do. Yeah, you'll fight. It's all good.
brother and vassal can fight in case he dies. Oh no, how terrible. But we in fine health? We are. And how's the sun doing? in here actually oh what's this finger bones of a king peddler in a cloak with dozens of baubles and knickknacks sewn onto it rattles up to me my lord i have an artifact of grand illusion with which you may convince all you possess magical power she brandishes a colorful fabric worm on a very thin string Appears dormant at first, but by manipulating the thread, one can affect the illusion the worm has come to life. Think of how this will impress the ladies at court. That's not quite how I... Uh... <laughs> I'm not playing Puppet Master, 75 party gained, or I do enjoy some wriggling. Uh, every child in the court gains 10 opinion of you for five years. I gain the worm on a string artifact. Screw it. I do enjoy some wriggling. trinket right worm on a string attraction opinion minus 10 okay let's let's not equip that then just yet yeah it needs to be repaired now i might give that one well, actually i'm going to give that uh that's just a way of gaining loyalty i was thinking i'll give it to my son I can hold court as well. Uh, let's hold court now. Oh, we lost all that prestige we had. We had 2,000 odd. Should have uh, seen if I could have added any new traditions. I need to check that. All right, it's gesture to the first petitioner. The air is thick with anticipation as my brother, Prince Ragnar, approached me. My lord, I come with grave news. With the solution to fix the problem. It's become increasingly clear that the Norse and Icelandian are becoming more, perhaps even too similar paramount that we show them it is us Icelandian we're at the forefront of innovation and so celebration celebrate our rich Icelandian culture I'll be very stressed total acceptance gain 350 of prestige though range exhibition no need for to exercise our superiority over cultures let's screw it stress time we'll sort out the stress later Okay, the next one. Serious business. A frightful peasant strolls in uh, all too close uh, before a guard slips between us. Oh! He backs off with a wink, laughing through scant teeth. Your lordness, I come here from Mahitata. I can't even say it. I'm just a peasant. I can't even read. With a matter of great import. His eyebrows undulate. You see, King, back in my grandpappy's day, the mason put up a fence along the herbalist's father's field. But now it's fallen to bits. And of course, the grandson wants nothing to do with it. What did you say? Please go on. Common touch for 10 years, 40 stress. Steward catalog, go fix it, please. Um, I gain 80 stress. You're a fool, my fool. He becomes my court jester. Hmm. How does man get in? I... Oh god, that's so much stress to gain. I'm going to have to go for common touch. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I should like a uh, veal cutlet. Amid all the supplicants, um, Padita, who I thought was a prisoner in my house arrest, somehow appears before my throne. My lord, surely the food served to me in my prison rooms is of far worse standard than what you should serve a respected guest. Or is this truly the best your cooks can do? I should like baked truffles for my dinner from now on. Uh, Grimmer, my uh, shrewver, a champion. Runs into the room, panting. My apologies, my lord. I was guarding him. It was so charming, he duped me into letting him out. Chefs, cook him the finest uh, meal the land has ever seen. I gain some court grandeur. He becomes my friend. 
I gain more stress. House arrest means dignity. Let them roam the grounds. Allows them to go outside. Small health boost. Oh, Grimmy, you're unworthy to be called champion. He's dismissed. Uh, I'm going to go for that one, even though it stresses me out more. Because it increases my level. Lovely. So we are at baseline of 38. So we could do with things going up just a smidge. We're currently struggling, though. Even with all the banners. Our grandeur level is giving us a nice bit of renown and prestige. If I did that, that would take us over. Because we've got our army raised right now. Um, yeah, screw it. Let's do that. So we stay at five. Let's stick with that. Close the court. Uh, we could probably fix this actually by just um, doing a... Oh, my mother. I could make my mother a shield maiden. Yeah, you know what? Do it. Oh, it cost me 350 prestige though. Ah... Uh... I kind of like the idea of her being a shield maiden. We could probably use her to actually bring someone better into the court. Do, 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 do. Make me mother a shield maiden. Or can we find a spouse? Do we need anyone better in the court? Not really. They're all pretty well set up. Some of all skills. No. That's on fine spouse, isn't it? Well, even with some of skills, yeah. No, leave it. Um, when am I invading France? Uh, I'm not, because we're over in India. Far away from France. I won't be invading there. Um, let's put a pin in that, and maybe we'll make her a shield main if we get a load of prestige soon. Uh, let me go to my dungeons. Just keep raiding. Just keep raiding. 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 Dark thoughts. Oh, here we go. Yeah, we need to lower stuff. Oh, no. How stressed am I? Oh, God. Next level at 200. Yeah, that's going to knock me over. Um, I can't go on a hunt. Do, do, do. Or friend of humanity. Uh, I'm going to risk it. Overwhelmed again. Uh, no. Okay, it gets real bad. Right, we need to relieve some stress. Diligence, why my stress loss is not great. Uh, it's going to affect my fertility. When can we do a hunt and a grand feast? When I have more gold. Basically, when we get back from this raid. Do that to get me in positive gold right now. How far north do I plan on going? Uh, we'll go until we create the Empire of India. Ah, good. Spending time with my friend. The Lunatic Berserker. That's always safe. Um, there is, I believe, a decision that will appear to unite all, all three as the Indian Empire. So that we'll go as far north up here. We might take Tibet as well. I don't know. Yeah, we'll grab all of this. Pretty sure there's a decision to found the Indian Empire. more can I take? We've got a good amount. Okay, go up there. Do, 
daydream about gold. Five years plus three. No, it must stay awake. Let's try and lose some stress. Damn it. I slump off my stool. But I did still lose some stress, so that's okay. A snake at court. Heading for my chambers to enjoy some blessed sleep when I hear a faint rustle from the window. Just the wind, I think, until the wind starts to speak. Ingrid, open up my pet. It is I, Ragnar. Push the shutters open and lo and behold, a man has climbed up Ingrid's window. It's my brother, Prince Rag. <laughs> no. I mean, fair enough. If, if Ragnar wants to climb one up and uh, face the mighty giant Ingrid, good luck to you. What did you just call my cousin? You skirt chaser? Is he still trying to form a faction to go after me? He is. He's going to fail. Granary infestation. Oh, more stress. Take pity on them and open up my grain stores. Uh, go for that one instead. Right, head in here. Grab the last few regions. In return for this offer. Uh, decline, no. What's this? Greetings, King Tim of Icelandia. It's my rights, Cody. Due to inform you that irrefutable evidence has been unveiled proving your marriage with Queen Sif is uh, consanguineous in nature. This information will stay between the two of us if you end this holy union. What? You're blackmailing me? What? Oh, incestuous. Oh, um, no. Is she? Where does she hail from? Uh, oh, you're making stuff up. A divorcer? Hell no. Let's we argue for the sanctity of our marriage. God. Could gain incestuous. God, that's not good. 61% chance that I successfully argue for it. She was, I don't want to give him a weak hook. I mean, although, what's that going to do? Could just kill him off. I don't want to risk getting incestuous. Do that. I'm going to murder you, mate. Oh, but I, oh, because I'm compassionate. Oh, God, that is a terrible trait to have. I can't afford to stress myself out yet. What if I imprison you? Nope. Son of a gun. I'm in debt. You think? Petty vandalism. He gains just. Um, we don't want to affect his intrigue because we're building him up to be an intrigue character. So we don't want that. He gains arbitrary and perfect gate. Monthly income is lowered. But it does improve his intrigue. I'm going to gain some stress because I'm diligent. But yeah, screw it. That intrigue is going to be great. over here. Do you think your king has trouble pronouncing pronouncing all the Indian names? I mean, I have problems pronouncing them all, so yes. <laughs> Most definitely. Mm. 
No, Marshall's dead. Um, yeah, let's assign you in there. I should probably try and sway you. I'll sway Queen Sif. Yeah, I'm trying to do that so that I can romance you. I'll get you to 100 opinion of me. Go hit the... Oh, no, we're full anyway. Go drop the raid loot here and we'll keep on raiding, I think, for a bit. We are bleeding funds because of our men at arms, aren't we? So someone was asking, when didn't don't Norse factions or Norse faith or just Norse characters ha use prestige instead of gold for their men at arms? When did that change? Didn't we start off the campaign with using prestige, not gold? Why did that change? Raise a runestone. Cause uh, cost fifty gold, but yeah, that's fine. We don't have enough for the war elephants anyway. Do it for our dearly parted father. And where is our capital? Put them. Go for that one. When you change the feudal... Oh, right, right, right. When we... So it's when we took a kingdom then. Fair. Oh, it's because when I take feudal land. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough. I can become a poet. Stress loss. Nice. Or I can become a journaler. Stress loss 20%. Monthly prestige gains better. Let's go for... It's virtuous. Let's go for poet. We... Have we got a physician? Yeah, we do. Yeah. We are going to call a hunt. I was gonna call... I'm going to keep going raiding, aren't I? But... Got to do it. Right, you've dropped off all of that. Head on up and hit their capital, please. 42 gold right there. Hunt foragers. Yeah, do that one. Donation. from the wild yeah it didn't drop our stress much at all need to keep on dropping otherwise we're going to be in trouble grand feast next i think and hope that we get eager reveler or something like that it's 9 35 we've been we've been in india since oh we don't know when did we we should be able to see this history shouldn't we uh since 9 26 basically because we started over in Iceland and jumped all the way over here council's dead oh the marshal again he was really old okay no great marshals let's sort that out by getting a courtier to right on it my wife uh, da, 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 da. Fine spouse, maximum marshal, this guy, matrilineal, pull them into the court. Three, two, one, new marshal. Enjoy. Uh, do you know what? Yeah, let's make me mother a shield maiden. Go raid their northern territory, which is worth 29 gold and then 35. Happy days. Uh, 
360 for war elephants. Soon. Soon. Just keep raiding, just keep raiding, 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 raiding. We're going to go from here into these lands or keep going on over here. Uh, let's go through here first. Then that, then that. Shootership Perk. It's my domain, extort subject's opinion. Uh, opinions? Extort subject's decision. Yes. Raise voices at the ting meet. Uh oh. Otherwise occupied. They'll all tie themselves out eventually. Uh, they're all arguing at the ting. Tie themselves out. I can. Where is it? Extort subjects. Yeah, where are my loyal subjects? Give me some gold. Could go for health, but we're stewardship focused, so I'm not gonna do health gain just yet. Uh, don't worry, I will have everyone pay. Yeah, it's some tyranny, but not a big hit to our opinion, really. I think not. Demand conversion. Stewardship, Wolf. There's all of India's armies. Not a clue. Not coming to attack us. That's that's what. They're weaker than me. They're weaker than me. They're weaker than me. These guys do have a a large army, though. Yeah, here they come. Run away. Head back with your loot. Shouldn't be able to catch me. Nice. Oh, they're going to catch me now. Rock rope. Not good, not good, not good, not good, not good. Not good. Dang it. Oh. Is it Ingrid? Oh no, she chopped off somebody else's head. Nice. You will pay for this. I needed that coin. I'll have you. It'll swap the command around. Hopefully, we can get plenty of gold just ransoming all of you guys. Guess there's less soldiers to pay for upkeep. <laughs> yeah, that's true. It's fine. It's fine. Um, We can hold a grand feast. That's going to be my gold, but I still need to drop my stress, otherwise we're going to be in trouble. I think right now we probably need to do that rather than worrying about elephants. So, because otherwise we won't have a character happy anymore. Um, mm, 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 mm. How much longer till she's swayed again? We'll give it one more go and then we'll see if we better chance of seducing or romancing her now. Welcome, my friends. Beast, do please go on. 
Then we'll learn about her deviant secret. Lateral damage. Oh, she knocked something over. My, my queen, queen mother. These things happen. It wasn't my favorite piece. Yeah, no, do that because benevolent ruler, uh, stress reduction. Anything for stress reduction. Let's disband all. Let them build back up. Then we'll go raiding again. Guess depart. Until next time.